We have got to stop meeting like this. Do you come here often? Welcome to another car vlog because I don't know about how much I'll be recording whenever I get home because girlfriend has a headache. So I'm going to take a lot of drugs. The legal kind, the kind for a headache. Don't freak out. And go straight to night night I think. I'm headed home now. I didn't get to eat today. Today was freaking busy. Wow, I almost witnessed an accident. Hmm, maybe you should have just got in line earlier with the rest of us rather than cutting people off and almost getting rear-ended, buddy, huh? I left a bit late because I was doing some above and beyond passenger service, customer service gloriousness. And uh, now I'm gonna be probably stuck in traffic for a hot minute, because I'm not even on the highway yet. I'm still in line on the on-ramp. We still going, we still moving. We slowly, slowly. I wish this headache would go away. Are you guys doctors? The internet is always doctors. What does it mean whenever I have a headache from like here to all the way to here? And it's just like this side, just the temple and like the side. It's really in there in the temple. It's like, it's digging. He's in there. You know what I think today? Since I'm gonna be taking, um, since I'm gonna be taking some pain meds for my head, I think what I'm gonna do is also remove the fur from my body. Because I don't know if you know this or not. If you know me in person and know me well, then you do know this. I have like ridiculously sensitive skin. Like I can't shave. If I shave, I get, um, shave bumps but not like just everybody gets shave bumps these shave bumps turn in and they're all over my body not just like in the lady bits um they turn into ingrown hairs within like a half an hour and if i don't like dig them out they turn into cysts within the day and i've tried all the creams i've tried retin-a's i've tried um the B1. Benzoyl peroxide. I've tried everything. I've tried waxing instead of shaving, which shaving is the worst. I'll never shave again. But um, it still happens even if I wax or do anything like that. I've been trying epilating recently since my friend told me about it, which seems like it is kind of helping a little bit, at least for a little while until, of course, the hair starts growing back and then I'm screwed again. But it's kind of a funny sight. And it does hurt like a bitch. If you don't know what it is, it's basically... Like, you know those trimmers that your dad probably has because he shaves his head? It looks like trimmers, except it, like, cur like turns like that. And it's basically, like, 40 pairs of tweezers that are motorized. And you glide it across your skin. And it just plucks all the hair out. And boy, does it not freaking feel good. Because if you've ever plucked one hair and you went, ow, that hurt. Yeah, try plucking 40 at a time. <laughs> it hurts really bad. So I always take some kind of pain pill before I do it or else I can't handle it. It hurts too bad. But beauty is pain, right? Uh -huh. The hair doesn't collect in the, in the thing. You have to like sweep it up after if you're gonna do it. So what I do is I just sit in the bathtub and I just do it there. That way I can just rinse it down the fucking drain. Smarter, not harder. No, don't put the brakes on. We're on the highway. You must do the one on the right. If you press the one on the right, we go more. If you press the one on the left, we have to stop. And we shouldn't do that on the highway because it's dangerous. I really want sushi. When I get home, I'm going to try to convince Babushka to go out for foods. Unless she made foods, then I'll eat the foods. But if she didn't make foods, she doesn't like sushi, so we'll stop someplace for her. Mom, pick up some sushi for me. That sounds good. By the way, I don't know if you don't know this, but I really like snow, and I like the winter time, and winter is my favorite with the snow. And uh, I have to live in Hawaii, and I don't like it. You know, I like the people, and I like the food, but like other than that, no thank you. Um, and uh, it is like brighter than hell, hotter than fuck. And uh, I'm kind of over it. Kind of over it. It is December. 
Vlogmas Day 9! And, uh... There's no snow. It is bright. There are palm trees around, and it's not right. Ooh, look at me. Call me Dr. Seuss. Hey, so like, I decided on my own that I'm gonna eat sushi today, and Bubba's gonna eat Aloha salads today. So I'm gonna run around and get these things, and I've just arrived at the sushi place. In the, I'm gonna go order. Listen, if you don't know what to get me for Christmas or a birthday, I highly recommend the sign on the door as an idea. Just saying. You're Baba. What happened to you? Sisha stopped to get some stuff. I got foods. You got foods. I got foods. From where? Aloha salads. Oh. Oh. I guess you didn't even have to ask me where I want. No, I knew. <laughs> <laughs> I know Miss Wee. Hi, baby. Uh, wondering what. Look at all this. Oh, boy. Ooh, I'm going to go wrap. I got you two, just in case. Thank you. Oh, I am hungry. Mmm. Where? I don't have no food. I did it again, guys. I did it again. I done ate all that food. And I went into a food coma. And I went night night on the couch. I messed up. I messed up. So I'm just gonna go to bed tonight. I'll edit tomorrow and the vlog is gonna be late, but I gotta go to sleep. I can't handle it. I'm just gonna go night night. You ready, baby? Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh my goodness. Wow, baby. Happy Vlogmas Day 9. Good night.